Welcome everyone, you want to factory reset without using a passcode and the first step is we're going to press and hold both power and volume up for 10 seconds. We're then going to release power and volume up and we're going to press and hold power and volume down. Let's do this together, otherwise it may be a little bit finicky. So we're going to start in 3, 2, one press and hold power and volume up keep these two held down do not release and i'm going to start counting now six seven eight nine ten release power and volume up now press and hold power and volume down and keep these two held down until we see a certain screen so this may take a little bit of time and when we see this here, fast bit mode, release from power and volume down. What we need to do from here is we need to click up and keep on clicking up until we see recovery mode. If you, your screen isn't working, then just click up the amount of times you saw I did. And once we see recovery mode, we're going to click the power button to enter recovery mode. So from here, we see no commands. The commands is while holding down the power key. So press and hold power key, and then click and release volume up, and then release the power button. We are now in the recovery mode. So from here, you don't use your touch screen. Instead, you click and release volume down, and click and release volume up to navigate, and then you click the power button to select. So what we're going to do is we're going to click volume down and then it's going to keep on clicking until we see wipe data slash factory reset. And then we're going to click the power button. And then we're going to click volume down and you see factory data reset. Click and release the power button and now you can see the data is going to start wiping. So we're going to patiently wait for the data to wipe. You can see data wipe has been completed. And now we need to click and release the power button to reboot system now. So after the reboot, you're going to see the Google is going to do the factory reset process. And once this is done, you'll be brought to the hello screen. But please keep in mind, if there was a Google account stored on this phone, you will need to re-enter in the login information for that Google account, otherwise you'll be locked out. This is just to prevent people who you know, steal the Google phone from the street from you know, using the stolen phone. So you have to have owned this phone, otherwise you'll be locked out for good. With that being said, if you would like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye-bye.